Hey, what's up guys, Soldier Knows Best here with an unboxing with another competitor in this ever-growing tablet marketplace. This is the Barnes & Noble Nook tablet. Now this just came out today, it has a seven inch vivid view color touchscreen, which has a resolution of 1024 by 600. It also does have a one gigahertz dual core processor inside of it, one gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabytes of it built in internal memory, but it's upgradable to 32 gigabytes of memory uh, with a micro SD card. You can place that right in that slot. That's what she, uh, anyway, it has 11.5 hours of reading and about nine hours hours for uh, video playback so it should have pretty good uh, battery life here as you can tell by those specs and also too it should be a nice little powerful machine but all this comes in a price of $250 that's one of the big selling points so again this is going to be a real big competitor to the Kindle Fire but about, without further ado I'm going to get into the unboxing here gonna see how we're gonna get inside this thing cut some of that plastic off and uh, some other little perks of it, if you go, of course, this is from Barnes & Noble. If you ever go there a lot, you get free Wi-Fi with them. You get online with them and browse the web with this tablet, free of charge, and some other cool things as well. But I'll cover that in a, a little bit more of an in-depth review. And let's go and see here how we're going to get inside this here. Oh, I guess it just pops open like that. First, I'm going to pop up this one. It's just going to be all the little cables and stuff. All righty, so just got a USB cable there, and this is a wall. The wall charger here, the wall adapter, like that, like so. There it is. All right, and now let's go ahead and see the tablet itself. There it is. There's the Nook tablet. All right, what we got underneath here? All right, get the instruction manual right here. We don't need that. And we have some geek candy. Again, kids don't eat that. <laughs> it's only for responsible geeks. Um, anyway, let's go to get the plastic off of this tablet and here it is and I was tell you this is definitely lightweight uh, very very lightweight and again a lot of the similarities between the uh, Nook color uh, which is their color version there the e-reader that came out I think a little bit earlier this year but anyway this is a tablet it's more powerful it has a little bit more um, options with it that's why the big difference with it let me see how you turn this thing on I think you just hold down the home button. No, you don't. There's probably a power button on here somewhere. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I do need to hold down the home button. One of these buttons. I'm just pressing buttons. Oh, on the side. Hopefully that works. There it is. <laughs> there it is. So the power buttons on the side. And we have some volume buttons here on the left hand side. Again, the home button right there. And the headphone jack at the top. So here it is. Turn it on right now. A quick little comparison between this biggest competitor, I think it's going to be um, this holiday season, also to just in general. And this is the Kindle Fire. Just looking at the uh, the size. Let me turn this on. Looking at the size difference here. So the Nook uh, tablet is just a little bit taller, uh, width wise, I believe. There. Oh yeah, and the Nook tablet is a little bit. Uh, wider as well but i would tell you that the the, the the nook color or the tablet is actually lighter than the the kindle fire so that's one difference there and i do like the just the overall feel the touch and finish of the uh nook tablet both of them feel pretty nice but i do like the feel of this so anyway guys this is going on way too long here so i'm gonna get this thing set up here i may do like a first impressions of the of my tablet so far uh, maybe a little bit later on today but anyway guys stay tuned i'm gonna do a, a nice stark comparison between this and the kindle fire so stay tuned for that because a lot of people really wondering about how this thing is going to perform against that but anyway guys leave a comment down below what you think about the the nook tablet and thanks for watching guys and i will catch you later peace